In another development, the presidential candidate of the Labour Party, Mr. Peter Obi, has expressed surprise that the federal government was yet to respond to the catastrophic flooding in Bayelso State after three weeks of disaster. Obi said flying into the state in a chopper gave him a better aerial view of the situation and that the state needs urgent help. He paid a courtesy visit to Governor Duyodere at the government house before the both visited internally displaced persons at the Oxbow Lake Pavilion Camp in Yenagoa. What I saw today, Your Excellency, my appeal, which I will be more vocal about, is for the federal government of Nigeria to send if the president or the vice president cannot visit Baeza, they must send a very strong team to come and see what is happening here. I've never seen what I saw by Asa. This is the top place I'm visiting. And I can say, federal government of Nigeria needs to declare emergency. On his part, Governor Diri lamented the impact of the flood, which he said has claimed lives, property, and destroyed the economy of the state. I'd like to thank you on behalf of this state. And this is what we are talking about. It is not that you will come and give by Elsans all the food they need, or all the money we need. Right now, we are even thinking beyond the flood. Nigeria is not a tripod. Yes. In the north, you have some dominant ethnic groups. In the southwest, you do have. In the southeast, you do have. In the south-south, you do have. Others have become president. So if we are talking about justice in this country, we all know in our hearts where it should go to. And that is what has been putting this country in quagmire. That this country cannot move forward. The way we have unbundled NNPC, the way we have unbundled NNPC, we advocate that Nigeria should be unbundled. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.